quite the fan service episode we had last week, huh? But of all the girls, or actually of all the fan service we got, do you know who was showing the most ass, the most fucking cheeks? It was Poe! Why is he so fucking cheeked up on a Wednesday? God damn! He had more ass than any of the seven shades. You know, I gotta give credit where it's due. Now, we're going into a brand new arc. I believe this is recapturing the Oriana Kingdom. And I think Zeta and another member of Shadow Garden has already been dispatched. Let's see what's gonna happen in today's reaction. Every time I see pink haired girls, I wonder, Sherry Barnett? So Sid has been gone for a while, right? He's ghosting Shadow Garden right now because he feels like a little guilty from the last arc. I don't know. I am just the one that... The one, he who lurks in the shadow to hunt the shadow, that, that's it. What does he want? <laughs> Does he Lady, you're not even thinking about the same shit we're thinking about. <laughs> oh, I thought something got cut there. Isn't that Nami? 6465! The blonde girl right here, I love her so much. That means Oriana must be near here too then, right? So, maybe Shadow Garden already dispatched this elite group, right? Already? Because... It's just Oriana. Goddamn. White. I see it. Yes, white. I'm sorry for making... Jesus Christ. I feel so bad for making a comment about Oriana's panties. And then suddenly she's sobbing in bed. That was bad timing, dude. Okay, recap. Season 1 finale. Remember, killed her dad to pretty much, like, show him mercy so he can be freed. Oh my She's haunted by it. Hmm. <laughs> Still white. 559. The one with Zeta, right? Beat 89. Remember, the triple, the unnamed numbers from 26 to like 666, they can request a challenge. They can challenge like a, like a duel. Request a duel against like the named numbers. And then they can like be accepted. Or did I just say 26 to 666? I meant like the triple digit ones. Actually, technically, everyone below 26 is, like, unnamed, so they should also fall in the same category? I'm not sure. Oh. There she is! This girl was in the trailer! <laughs> the perfection. Lord Perv Asshat. <laughs> what a fucking name. The children of Diabolos, okay. Yo, she's always eating something, man. Because this is my kingdom? Oh? Damn! Even using a real name now. Yeah, that's rare. That No other girl other than the Seven Shades have gotten power like this. Actually, I'm not completely sure. There might be others. Nah, everyone else didn't get the same treatment as Oriana. No one else directly gets powers like that. She too? Okay, 559 is different. Ooh. Might as well be honorary, you know. Seven shades. Damn. One-on-one -on -one duel right now. Yo, she's talking a lot of shit. I hope she's really strong. What's going on? Wait, 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 what? what? That name? Uh, oh, okay, this is the Children of Diabolos? That voice is so deep. This soundtrack is so good right now, too. What the fuck? Huh? The one that Nelson had. Baldi! I forget what it does, though. <laughs> huh? Your majesty. She's got curls, too. Mom? Oriana's mom? Why is she involved? Is she also possessed right now? The one who... The one who slit... Slit what? SLE what? All she came was to just <laughs> pivot that thing. Okay, what does that do? Royal Blood was the key. Okay, that's the episode title, the key. Hero Freya. Which one is that? There's a human hero, elf, and a beast hero, right? Which one is that? Gotta be human, right? Cold. So cold. 559 is all business. Let's see. Damn, she's getting the Queen Elizabeth theme right now. Right after her mom, dude. <laughs> Oriana stopped, right? I don't blame her. That's kind of fucked. Yo, her mom's get there. Do you see that? So she's not possessed? Is she? 
Well, she's part of the plot. I mean, we should be trying to rescue her, right? This guy's voice is so deep. Okay, so she is a hostage. Unless it's an act. <laughs> Yo, her introduction is so savage. I love her. 559 is kind of right. Like, for the mission, you shouldn't be doing this, but I don't blame her. She's fucking saving her mom. Oh, so cute. Plushies. Whose room is this? Ooh, Gamma. Oh, this is Gamma's room? Damn. Notice how every time there's exposition, like war, boring stuff, there's a lot of fan service while they're doing a lot of dialogue. Mordred, finally another round member. Like none of these like round to bees like Zenon Griffey and fucking like Ketan was also apparently like a like a candidate, but this is an actual member, Mordred. Wait, I'm just starting to realize it's Knights at the Round Table. Mordred, there's probably gonna be like Arthur Pendragon, you know? Fuck, I played Fate Grand Order. I remember those knights' names. I forget them right now, though. Is that Mordred right there? Is Mordred Dio's voice actor, the one that was talking to Lord Perv Asat in season one finale? Anti-perv and the pro-pervs. <laughs> yeah, you can come in and save the kingdom. You know, save us. Who should become the new ruler? <laughs> no, not you. Okay, her misunderstandings are actually pretty funny. Shadow can't just become the king. If Oriana reclaims it, though, who will she marry? Can Sid Kagino just show up there and become the king? But Sid Kagino can't be like that, though. Yeah, so who's the male candidate, you know, to match? <laughs> To free him. Kind of. Yeah, because you pretty much told her that you'll support her. Yeah, right here. You gave him the burger wrap and he was like, yeah, do your thing. Go ahead. That's the thing. He's got to be the mob character. He himself can't... Well, if it's the monarch, maybe she can't just be the, just the queen and there doesn't need to be like a king. I don't know. No, not not the orange juice. Huh? Oh, look at this piece of shit. Bald! Bald! Sid, do something. Sid, come on! Sid, come on, you can't get her get robbed like this in daylight. Oh. Sid, come on! Shadow, where you at? Uh-oh. Mob character time. <laughs> Look at his legs, dude. Perfect form. Mob foo. God damn, what is that ass, dude? It might be more cheeked up than Poe last season. Also, why the fuck is his pants down? Why is there smoke coming out of his bussy? What did they just do to him? Okay, what else did they take from you, bro? Oh! That, that's crazy! She's here now! She doesn't even know she is safe. Shadow saved her. But in the city, Shadow, he, she doesn't even. That's crazy. Does Shadow even remember this? Yeah, it's almost like they're the same person. I bet Sid doesn't remember. Twice. Bye bye. Mob food technique. Even the talking was swollen there. Pristine form. Oh? Is that Oriana wanted poster there? Stand out by not standing out when standing out. Sure, you gotta be very flashy while not being flashy while trying to be flashy. Oh, it's these guys again. Bald! Bald! Treasure. If treasure's involved, Sid will go get it. Well, he's already dead. Wait, you're already dead too. Wait, 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 wait. They all just died. It was Sid, right? Okay. He just came and he's just looting them. Okay. Oh, I got the crowbars out. Stylish bandit slayer mode. Based. Damn, that was cold. Even with a smile. Mary again. Oh, Sid just show up and, you know, give the fucking loot back to her. 
Okay, I'm like, why are you touching your titty for a second? Nice, he dropped the bag of gold there. What a nice guy. Interesting that they're bringing Mary back into the show. I thought she was just like a random character that we just saved for fun, but like she's still here. God damn. Oh, shadow. Just a flash of it. So cool. It'd be funnier if he was around that corner and just like peeking around just to see if she's seeing or not, you know? Oh, it's 559 five, again. Oh, dry wind. Yo, you guys have too many like cool names for you guys to get wiped out immediately. Look at this. Three days, three nights just by herself? She's just wiping off the entire first children? Ah, oh, don't say some creepy shit, dude. Wait! 6 is 4! 6 is 5! No! Where's Oriana? Something's in the moon there. Do you see it? Something's in the moon there, dude. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Again. What was their encounter? What the fuck? She's powering out! Her arm! What? Her powers is that regeneration? Too? <laughs> this voice acting is so sus. Yo, this reminds me of the frame where Oriana got her powers. This same po soundtrack was also playing when she defeated all those cult members immediately. Take me and what? Take me and what? I thought Shadow would save her there, but nah, he was just chilling. And then she just got so horny looking. They're healed too! So she can heal others? Wow, her personality changed so quick. <laughs> the money. Where's the money at? No, she's not a traitor. No, she's just trying to save her mom. His employee Does he not even know the meaning of the numbers? Yeah, context, bro. I mean, kind of true. I don't think... Okay, Shadow's not going to be listening to this. It's going to be fine. Friends! Damn, 559 is just so cold. Bounty? Oriana again? Oh. You care about that? Huh? What does she want? Wait, 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 wait. I didn't think he was interested in Rose. <laughs> How dare you marry another person? Bro, this was from last season, Shadow. Ooh. He gone. He gone. I'm kind of worried for Oriana now. To free the dad. Bro was not paying attention to the plot last season. Uh-uh. <laughs> Dude, the marriage was a fucking thing from last season. Actually, that might be new news. That might be actually new recent news, actually, because it's been three days. It might actually be recent news. He's gonna save the princess, dude. Lord Pervasa? Ooh, goddamn, he gonna die. Yeah, I think I misunderstood that at the end when you see the wanted poster and then Shadow was like, wait, what the fuck, Rose Senpai, you're getting married? Technically, the marriage and the stuff was in season one, but maybe some other news kind of developed during the three days that 559 was fighting. She is so strong. She can also apparently heal others. This is a Mahoka Onisama regrow ship, right? Actually insane. And she fought for three days, three nights. Actually super strong. One of the two members outside of the seven shades that actually got power directly from Shadow himself. That's a huge deal. Her personality, cold, ruthless, objective. As soon as Shadow Soul shows up, dere dere, just horny. God damn, she's great. She's a little mean though, huh? Oriana. Seems like it's going to turn into a Save the Princess arc. But I want Oriana to be, you know, I want her to be like a strong, independent woman who don't need no man, you know? I want her to fucking kill Lord Perv Asset. Destroy everybody. Shadow will be there as the fixer, you know? He who has to show up and be flashy while not being flashy, but being flashy at the same time. Who knows how that's going to happen? It's looking like it's going to be a fun arc. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.